What's up guys? This is your boy Passive Crypto. About to drop another banger. Protect your net. If you're new to this channel, this channel is about making money and passive income. If you like any one of those things, give me a like on this video, subscribe to this channel, click that notification bell, and then select all. That way you guys will be the first people to get these bankers. Protect your neck. All right, let's get it. The crypto market, you guessed it, is still bloody red. I mean, look at it. It's all red. Red, red, red. Bloody red. But your boy, about to make some money. About to get these Gs. So stay tuned. Watch this whole video. Because this is a, everything's down except for about the stable coins. And your boy's still making good money. Let's do it. Look at my indicators. So this is some stuff right here, man, before I get to the money. I'm going to give you an update on this IDO I just entered to uh, LPI. But look at my indicator. So this is kind of interesting right here, what happened right here, man. Um, a group of people, I'm going to say a group of people, I'm calling them the others. They're trying to raise the market back up. You know what I'm saying? And they got a significant amount of money to play with too because um, I guarantee you what happened was they use the money flow. Because the money flow would tell them to get in around this point right here. My indicator um, isn't like money flow, but it does have some of the same characteristics. So they probably was using the money flow algorithm, and it was telling them to get in. And you can see that the it price dropped down to like 39000 Then they got back in, and they rose the price up. And you can see it right here. They was even able to pull, pull off. The price trading sideways and turning these bearish candles into uh, congested candles. So this is pretty interesting, you know what I'm saying? How, but I'm I'm a, I'm gonna talk about this at the end of the video. Let's get to the updated IDO. So the IDO on um, E uh, Leah Corn, which is Elon's launch pad. A token that was called LPI Dow. I'm pretty excited about this token. Um, the listing price for this token will be 25 cent. I mean, 50 cent. We got in at 25 cent. Uh, this is just one of my two wallets. I was able to, to contribute the max, which was 1.4 BNB. I ended up with 2,127 LPI tokens. The listing will be around 12:30 p.m. my time. And um, I'm in the Midwest, so you basically just got to put in 16:30 UTC, your time, and then it'll tell you exactly what time the listing will be in your time. Um, it, the listing will be on Pancake Swap, as far as I know, that's my understanding. But around 12:15, 12:30, I'm gonna go into Lit. Eloin's um, telegram. I'm gonna go to the pin messages and they should post a contract address. I won't go to the telegram and just look for the contract address in the telegram. I'm gonna go to the pin messages, which will be at the top. They're gonna pin a message and that should have a contract address in there. So I have two wallets, so I have over over four thousand tokens. So according to the article, only twenty percent will be released. And then 80% will be will be released in 30 days. So I got four over 4,000 tokens. Let's do the math on that. So 4,000 tokens. Stay tuned too, because I'm about to show you the money. I'm about to show you these G's your boy about to make in a bear market. Well, bear cycle. It's not bear bear market yet. So so over 4,000 tokens times 20% is how much tokens I will receive. I'm doing this right. 800 tokens. So I see around 800 tokens. Um, and I'm going to sell these whole 800 tokens. Now these other tokens, the other 3,200, I will be receiving them in 30 days from tomorrow. So that's going to be even more money I'm going to get. But these 20, I'm about to sell these. Hopefully I'm able to get the 10x. Um, now I contributed 1.4 BNB. So... The price of BNB right now, let's see what the price of BNB is right now. So 1.4 BNB. Stay tuned, man. Don't leave yet. Hold on. I didn't get to the money yet. Hold on. Give me a minute. I'm trying to get to it. I know you want to hurry up. You know you got stuff to do. 
But I gotta finish this first. So 1.4 BNB. What the heck? Why the decimal ain't coming in there? It's $487. So I'm gonna round it up to $500. So I invest about $1,000 because I got two wallets. And I'm expecting this to, the listing price will be 50 cents. So I'm, I'm gonna double my money, at least double my money. So that'll be at least two grand. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna make, and I'm expecting this to do a 10X instead of an 8X. So in my opinion, instead of $2, I think it might go to like three or four. So we gonna see, and if I'm right, um, if it go to three, I got 800 tokens. That'd be eight times three is 240. If it goes to four, that'd be $3,200. So anywhere between $2,400 and $3,200 is what I'm expecting to make tomorrow um i will make another video showing you guys how that went all right let's get to the money so let me get back to this so it's a token that i got into on oxbull tech right oxbull tech now I've, I've been telling people oxbull tech it's kind of pricey now to get an idos i mean it's real pricey now you know i'm not even in it because you know it's, it's it's pricey you know what i'm saying but if the price the market keep dropping like i think it's gonna drop then um i'm probably gonna hop in I, um oxbow tech get in tier one oxbow tech but back to this so this was the video i did on april the 30th right and it was a token i got into called atura now check this out listen to this I mean, but it was a lot of money. So let me show you guys. Hold on. So let me rewind this back just a little bit. Be patient. I do the math. Three hundred seventy dollars. Hold on. Let me get it right. Okay. So the max allocation was three hundred seventy dollars. Uh, I got into tier one a tour NFT. It was called Plutus or Pluto before, but they had to change the name. Right? They had to change the name. Let me speed this up. I'm trying to get it sped up for you guys. All right, check this out. What's the price? I got in at point zero 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 five seven. I got in at point zero 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 five seven. That's how much I got in an IDO on Oxbow Tech for Artura, which was called Plutus or Pluto, something like that. Uh, this was like April the 30th when I posted this, so probably like April the 29th. Alright, check this out. That was the pre-sale price I got in. When I, I only spent $370. That was my initial investment. I think I sold it at five cents. So I want you guys to do the math. $370. I put in, I got a lot of tokens. And then Alright, let's get to that. Like so that, I can man. show you guys what happened after so that. Right? So $370, I got in at .00057. That was my initial investment. All right, so here's the proof. I will tell you, you make a lot of money. So this is my transaction. Right, so I got 324,000 ALU. Dang, I didn't even know it was that much. Man, I just hurried up. Look, when I went to Pancake Swap and put the, you know, I had to get the, uh, contract address because a lot of these uh, pre-sales and stuff when they list it doesn't pop up when you go to the search bar and you type the, uh, the ticker in so I had to get the contract address from a uh, the Altura, uh website and then I pasted it in and then it popped up and then I compared it to the BUSD just to see how much one was and when I saw what it was I hurried up and hit max and I saw you know my original plan was to um all right, make a long story short, I invested three hundred seventy dollars. I got three hundred twenty-four thousand Altura. Now, now, on these IDOs, the the ones I get in, the launch pads I get in, you don't get your whole allocation of your tokens up front. You get a portion up front, then you get a portion in the back end. Sometimes it's every month you get some, or every week you get some, all the way until you get your whole hundred percent. But you don't get everything up front. So initially, I got three hundred twenty-four thousand. Altura tokens. I sold them for 2060 BUSD. My initial investment was $370. So I made around $1,600, right? 
So on the back end, I got another 324,000 Altura, right? Now remember, the price was 0 .00, was it four, something like that. The price went all the way up to like, the height, it was at six cent, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's see the all time high. So the all time high, yeah. Uh, two days ago was six cent. And guess what? Your boy got another 324,000. Where they at? You know what? Let's go to the site first. I got to go to the site. Because this is where they at. I got to go get them. So let's go to the site so you guys can see this. You know what I'm saying? I'm documenting all this. Your boy doing it. So this is what the Artura website looked like. Hold on, man. Don't click off yet. I'm about to show you the money. It's an NFT platform. NFTs is hot, you know what I'm saying? I don't know too much about NFTs. I'm not going to act like I do. Like a lot of these uh, YouTubers that's perpetrating the fraud, talking about how much money that other people can make, but they not really showing you the money they making. They just throwing numbers out with no documentation, by the way. It's an NFT platform. Make a long story short. You can do a lot of stuff with NFTs on AturaNFT.com. They have a marketplace. They have all this stuff. But they also have a place where you can stake your tokens. So when I got my other allocations of tokens, I had staked them. You know what I'm saying? The platform kind of looked like a beefy type platform where you can only stake uh, the Altura tokens. So you can stake them outright or you can pair them to BNB. See, they got two of them. L L L U B N B. Um, the APYs is super fat on this. You can make 0.77% uh, daily. But here's mine right here. You see that? I've been staking it. And I got 335,000 tokens. You see what it's worth. Let me blow that up. You see what it's worth, right? An initial investment of $370. I don't know how many. What's the percentage gain on that? One of you math whiz. Tell me that. What's the percentage gain on this? But anyway, your boy about to take this out. You know what I'm saying? I'm probably going to regret this later. But I need that. So I'm going to go ahead and withdraw the max. There's a little fee they're going to charge for that. I'm about to go ahead and withdraw this max. And I'm about to cash this out. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to cash this out. So I'm about to see. You know what I'm saying? So that's 17K. I'm going to round it down to 17K. Zero, zero, zero. That's 48 BNB if I want it right now. I can swap that out for 48 BNB. Where the platform at? So boom, it should be in my wallet. It's right there in my wallet. Let's go to Pancake Swap. Let me refresh this page real quick to make sure they pick this up. And you no, know, this is the power of IDOs. This is just one example. You know what I'm saying? Now, granted, I had to wait a couple months before this boy pick up, but NFTs is booming right now. I mean, it's it's booming. What can I say? Let's see. You about to see how much BNB your boy can get. Come on, come on, baby. Tabulate this. Let me go ahead and get some of this this clutter out the way so we can pick it up. I'm about to change this slippage too. Look at that, 48 BNB. Let me go ahead and change this slippage. That's 48 BNB I can get right now. But because of my indicators, you know what I'm saying, it's not looking good. You know, people pushing it up, man. They trying to break this. <laughs> they trying to break this bearish trend. And they might be successful, man. I don't know. I don't know. They trying. This candle right here going to show it all. You know what I'm saying? It's going to close in 41 minutes. They trying to. But back to the money. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting sidetracked again. So what I'm going to do, you know what I'm saying, until I see what my indicators do, I'm going to cash this out into uh to to to, to BUSD. You know what I'm saying? I'm keeping it in BUSD. That's 17 grand. Let me go ahead and get this money, baby. Now, everything bloody red. How many YouTubers making 17 grand in one day and it's down market. 
Now you can watch all these YouTubers that got all these subscribers, hundreds of thousands of subscribers, millions of views, and they talking about this and that. They talking about this and that and this and that. I got think I gotta raise my slippage. Yeah, it fell. So let me go ahead and raise this slippage up. You know what I'm saying? They 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 uh playing with my money. I'm gonna put it at one percent. Let's try this again. So how many YouTubers? I'm asking y'all. You know, your favorite YouTuber, that person that got all those subscribers that's talking about, you know what I'm saying, crypto every day and they experts. How many of them? Making 17 grand in one day. You seeing it right here? Look at that. It went through 335,000 LU ALU for 17 G's. Hey, you know what I'm saying? What's the saying? You can lead a horse to water, but you can't make it drink it. Can't make them drink it. You know what I'm saying? I made a video about this in April. You know what I'm saying? About ALU and the dirt cheap price. It was 0 .00. Was it zero five? I mean. What can I say? Bam, it's in my wallet. You see it right there, right? Let me blow that up for you guys. How much I got in my wallet now? $25,702. I made 17 grand in one day. That's why I keep telling you guys, it's not the size of the YouTuber's channel. It's the size of their bank account. And your boy, this is, like I say, it's the money team, man. Get with the winning team. 17 grand in one day. All right, now, this is for the geeks, you know what I'm saying? Everybody else, you know what I'm saying? That's, probably, that's what y'all's probably waiting on to see your boy make these 17 Gs. Let's get back to the chart. These are for the people that are interested in charts and the market. Where is it at? Where is it at? Where my chart go? That ain't it. All right, look. So this is the stuff that's interesting. Let me blow this up, man, so you guys can really see this stuff. So, move out the way. So look, right here, you see the market drop, you see the Bitcoin drop down to like 39,000 and then uh, uh, people automatic buys drop, bump one in because they indicators telling them 39,000 is the bottom, uh, get in, make some money. It went up and then it traded sideways for a couple hours and then boom, it went up again, see, but the money flow would tell them to get in because, uh, you know, the money flow probably was trending up right here, right? And it got a bullish indicator right here, right? Because this and this right here is kind of similar to money flow, but it is, but it ain't. But it's pretty much give off the same type of signals. So, so people got in, right? And they rolled it up. And boom, this actually turned bullish. And a bullish indicator. So all she was trying to make some money. and But this is what they didn't count on. They did it at the beginning at the end of a bullish cycle and not at the beginning so all they did was just stretch out uh, the beginning of a bearish cycle right and then they ran out of gas so it dipped and you can see that dip and then the bearish cycle started which pulled it pulled the curtain back boom it dropped right so now they trying it again. So this is what's interesting. You know what I'm saying? They trying it again. They trying to figure out because the indicators telling them it's bullish. You know what I'm saying? They've been telling them that for like like 12 hours. You know what I'm saying? Maybe 24 hours. They've been telling them it's bullish. So they can't figure out how come they can't make this boy pop up. You know what I'm saying? Um, my my indicator still saying it's bearish. You know what I'm saying? Until we get above this line, you know what I'm saying? And my indicators start giving out bullish signals it's still bearish i mean they, they they bumping their head against the wall that's what's happening right now but however if they able to do this for another i say about three four hours this cycle probably will end in the morning sometime in the morning it's like 9 22 right now so sometime in the morning around three four five in the morning this bearish cycle will, will start to end and a bullish cycle will start on this indicator. So if they able to put all this money that they putting in trying to pop this boy above this line, um, they might be successful. But they got a long way to go. Now this is what's scaring me, cause I, if they if they not able to get above this line, which is forty three thousand, 
I say about 40, you gotta get above it, so. 43,000, 40, I say about 44,000. They not able to get above this line. Look what's gonna happen. This is another, This is my bearish indicator, right? Look what's gonna happen. Um, this will help, this top is turning yellow. Yellow means uh, it won't move as much. But if this top turns blue when this candle closed, finito. But this is what I'm gonna get back to, then I'm gonna end this video. So look, you know, it's starting to trend bearish, right? This is bearish, but it's about to come up. But it's gonna be some a couple hours from now. So that means probably about four candles gonna close be between that time. Look what's look what is look, you see this red point? You see where is that? Look across to the right. Is that point neg zero is a negative point zero one, right? Look how far it could drop. It can drop all the way down to negative point zero nine. You see that, right? You see the big difference? So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight layers it could drop, which would drag the hell out of Bitcoin. Which would it would it would roll over. You see this high high rolled over right here? It went up, went up, then whoop. Now it's going up again, and then it, it's gonna go whoop all the way down again. You know what I'm saying? If they not able to keep this top yellow, you know what I'm saying, for at least another couple hours. You know what I'm saying? So it have to be this candle with this top yellow, then the next two candles with the top of it yellow. And then they could probably bust this out back above this line. But if they can't, the price is going to roll over and drop even lower. You know what I'm saying? Which would bring it down to around 36, 35,000. So, you know what I'm saying? This is this is for the geeks and the people that are interested in, in uh, chart. Uh, see, that's the thing. People want me to do technical analysis, man. I'm not a TA guy. I can do it, but I don't do it well. You know what I'm saying? I'm an indicator guy. I, I found some indicators that work. And I've been using them for a while, so I know every detail about them. And I know how they work together, and they all work together. It's only two or maybe three people on YouTube, well, one person on YouTube that knows these indicators. But they got a lot of data, and it's like information overload, so they don't know how to use all these together. They might use one or two together. Uh, CryptoFace uses some of these indicators he don't use all these, but he used a couple of them. Um, but it's on, and then it's one other guy that we, that the, uh, the one YouTuber and me got these indicators from. One guy had all these indicators, and this YouTuber I watched found these indicators, and he's just trying to use them, but he didn't stick with it long enough to see how they react to the market. I've been using them for a long time now, maybe like you know a long time. And crypto a long time and i know how all this work and it works together perfectly um now being with that being said man give me a like on this video if you like this content um this is your boy pastor crypto peace i'm out